Ma is basically concept grew out of the、uh, Shinto. So it's a relationship between the piece and the surrounding space. If you're a painter, you make a mark, then that mark itself, you're creating different concepts around the space of the mark. Without that mark, canvas has different meaning. Even though I'm making o b j e c t I spend probably as much time thinking about space around of it. Hopefully, peace has strong enough integrity to deal with different k i n d of e n v i r o n m e n t You know, the idea of Dango sort of developed. Pretty natural way. Like、uh, most of my ideas, I don't sit and think and then try to figure out conceptual i d e a It just grows out of me doing work. Usually, almost all ceramic artists start with wedging clay. But when you start wedging clay, it ends up round shape. One day I realized it's a pretty interesting shape, but it's so basic. I, I didn't have enough confidence to say, hey, this is good enough, just leave it alone. It probably took me about five, six years to convince me I should just make that as a piece and see how I feel. And that's how it started. If it's below my eye level, it's sort of still not threatening. But if I start passing my eye level, and if it went like a three, four feet up, then your physical feeling to the shape really changes. The scale itself has definitely power of its own. My interest of making big pieces is not a technical issue. But if I want to make a big piece, That comes with it, so I have to deal with it. Ninety-five percent of it is、uh, planning and the engineering. Clay body should be soft enough that you could connect, but as you go up, it has to be stiff enough to hold weight on top. So if you go too fast, obviously. Collapse. If you go too slow, you have a hard time to connect it. During the firing,、uh, there are lots of、uh, ceramic changes happening. So if you don't go easy at that time, that could be the biggest cause of the cracking. It happens on the way up, on the way down. Expansion and contraction of it. Basically, it is pretty much intuitive decision that you have to make through your past experience. 